Hey everybody, Heather from Hooked on Pickin' here. I have got my glasses on today because it's springtime and I've got itchy eyes, but I've also got a ginormous palette of 500 in one items. Let's see what we got. All right, so I've got 501 items to unbox, which I will show you each and every item, I promise. But let's give the specs on this palette. This is a bulk.com palette of 501 items, uninspected returns, which is my favorite category. I usually find stuff in really good condition. It's women's apparel, which I originally would not have chosen before, but my Poshmark store is doing awesome. And so I thought, hey, let's do some clothing. C9 Champion, Ava and Viv. I know both of those you can find on the Amazon platform from time to time. Nuvano, usually not on the Amazon platform, so that'll for sure be on my Poshmark. Um, it retails, and this is what the reason why I chose this, $9,695 is the original retail. Obviously, as a reseller, I know I'm not gonna make that. I usually make 20 to 30% off the, what the retail says, but we'll see once we see the condition. My cost was $740. And then this is one of the palettes that I picked up when I went down to visit the bulk.com warehouse. They don't do customer pickups right now, but I'm hoping with me as a guinea pig that this is something they start. So I added up um, my truck costs and my gasoline costs and hotel stay and all that stuff and divided it out with the number of palettes that I bought and it came out to $76 per pallet. And so that's what I charged myself for shipping, $816, which puts my per item cost at $1.63. If you would have bought this palette, it would have been $740 just like me, $200 of shipping for $940, and your cost per item would have been $1.88, so pretty similar to what I had. Let's see if we can find some awesome things and see what kind of condition women's apparel, 501 items. So you ready? This is going to be a marathon. I will try my best not to take forever on each item, um, but I definitely want to give you a good glimpse into what kind of condition is 501 items come in inside of a palette. So it looks pretty full to me, which I'm excited to see. We'll just open this all the way. They always have one side of the palette that's dropped a little lower, so it's a little bit easier to access. But so far I'm seeing some tags on things which also which makes me super excited so let's go ahead and just start pulling stuff out and then i'll lay it out to get to kind of give you guys a good look at the quality of items so we've got a green cardigan this would be perfect for christmas time but you never know people still live in cooler climates even though it's the beginning of spring like i said this is a medium still with tags 22 dollars original price so i might have to keep that one the hardest thing about doing clothing palettes for me is not wanting to shop for myself. Here's another one. Um, this one's an extra small, but the bonus is it's the exact same thing. This one does not have tags, but um, it does look brand new because I think it, the tag just pulled off. So if I find the tag, I'll go ahead and put it on there. Um, but because it was this exact same one, I just have to take one photo for my Poshmark store. All right, this one is... Um, $27 original price, another cardigan, but it's a darker green, more like a hunter green. I'll show you the back of it there. Just a plain, it's pretty soft fabric, a new day. Um, here's another one. This is like the first one because it's got kind of the tie backs on it. Um, and it's a size extra large. If you're looking for any of these items, most likely by the time that this video airs, it will all be listed on my Poshmark closet. Um, and the link is in the description below. But um, if you can't find it, it's under, um, the, my Poshmark store is actually under my hubby's name, Paul Hooks. So just look up Paul Hooks, all one word. This one's kind of a smock style. I don't see any picks or tears. Um, it's got pockets in it, just like that. I think I already pulled one out that looks just like it, this extra small over here. So I've got some duplicates. What is this? This is a jacket. Let me see. Size medium. This is a nice coat. Does it fit? What do you think? I might have to keep this one. Comes with a belt. Look at that. That's a good one. It's called Prologue. No tags on this one, I don't think. No, there is a tag. It says the original price was $40, so it, brand new with tags. All right, there's a black coat there. Let's see what else we got in here. 
Um, a black sweater, lots of cardigans and sweaters. Those are always really nice because they're, especially because they're plain colors, they're just gonna match everything and everybody's always kind of on the lookout. These ones have pockets in them. So I've got two different styles I've pulled out. That dark green had the pockets, extra large, original price, $28. So I'm gonna kind of keep it here near the same price. I dropped my tape, not articles of clothing. Zermatt snow pants or ski pants. Perfect time of the year. Perfect time of the year. It's almost May. That's all right. There's still people that live in Alaska. <laughs> so in Canada, you can buy stuff from Canada. The original, tag the original tag says that these are $40. These are size medium. So I would keep these for myself if I lived where I used to live in Michigan, but it only snows really like twice a year here. So those wouldn't be very economical to keep in my house. Uh, here's another pair, size large, new with tag. And they are, um, it says Zermatt Women's Technical. So those are nice. So already I'm seeing um, not very many different styles of clothing, which is gonna make for faster listings. So size large, this is kind of a, just like a shawl kind of, kind of goes with my shirt. It's got little ties in here. So that'd be very beachy if you wanted to wear that with a swimsuit cover up. This looks like a swimsuit cover up. Cover to cover is what it's called. So I would imagine it's a swimsuit cover up. We'll put it next to the snow pants. All right, here is a sweater. A white knit sweater. It's got a little bit of sparkle in it with some silver thread. Looks in good shape to me. I'll do some definitely better inspecting. Once I put it on a mannequin when I take pictures for Poshmark, I usually can tell if there's any discrepancies and things like that. Um, we've pulled out some of these already before, size large. So that's awesome. I love seeing duplicate pieces, especially when they're just um, generic, not generic, but they're, they're gonna match everything. This green cardigan will go with a lot of things because it's a solid color. And so here's a medium. So I can just add variations to my listings. Here's the exact same cardigan in kind of a burnt rust orange color. Um, but I'm gonna show you right now. Um, this looks like it had the tag on it, but it doesn't anymore. But I would not sell this one simply because of that right there. Um, it's got a pick in it real bad. So that would be something that I'm just actually going to right away throw on one of these front tables so I remember that there's a pick in that and that it doesn't end up in my Poshmark um, pile. Here's another cardigan. This one is a universal thread XXL. So it's a 2X. Original price is $30. Get the sleeve right side out here. Almost wish I would have brought my mannequin up and I could have just displayed it on there, but that would have taken forever. All right, here's a gray, kind of a gray with pockets. See the pockets here? Just like the green one I showed you. So I'm gonna put all the cardigans kind of over here just because I've kind of already started a pile there. A new day, here's a white sweater. It looks like it's got kind of a cross and a tie back. So this is a XXL. No, an extra large white sweater. What size does sell better? Um, I sell really, really well. Um, extra size, extra large and large. Plus sizes sell phenomenal. I usually blow out of plus sizes. Anything that's 2X, 3X, 4X, 5X. And yes, I do sell all the way up to 5X, 6X, all that. Smalls don't sell really well at all. Um, mainly, I think, because here's an extra large black cardigan. Um, not cardigan, sorry, extra large, just tank or cami. Um, part of the reason why smalls I think don't sell as well is because if you go to any store and check their clearance racks, there's extra smalls and smalls galore. Um, and so usually if you are an extra small or a small, you can find stuff on the cheap, usually at Kohl's or Walmart or Target. Here's a purple one, just like that white one, extra small. So just like that white sweater. Here's a black cardigan. So this one's gonna be great. It's just like the green ones. 
I've pulled out, but black always sells really well. This is a size large, so that's probably going to sell really well for me. Remember, I spent $1.63 per item, so do you think I can make more than a buck sixty-three For sure. I'll probably actually, on just this, just this one alone, the original price is $25. I'll probably make about $10 to $15 on a black cardigan because those are real popular. They go with everything that's a real soft material. I'm gonna make sure to mention that in my Poshmark listing when I make it. My hope is that I can actually put a lot of these on Amazon so that I don't have to do as much shipping. Here's a size small black cardigan. This is the one with the pockets. So it kind of has that smock look to it. Let's see, is this another one just like it? Yes. Here's another one exactly like it. Now this one does not have the tags. So I will probably make a couple of different listings of the black ones because I'll make ones with tags and without tags. Um, be, and just simply because, I mean, they're all brand new. I don't think they've been worn at all, but I wanna be specific in the way that I'm making my listings. Here's another one of those tank tops, cami tank tops. It's an XXL again. I'm hoping I find a medium or a large because these would be great to wear as undershirts underneath shirts like this. Like I've got a white tank top underneath this one. I've got some really nice shirts, but I like to double layer. All right, here is another one. This is a really nice soft cardigan. Oh, it's got three quarter sleeves. See the length of that sleeve is a little bit shorter. And this is a much thinner, softer, smoother material. This one's a medium. So you can kind of see, I can try on the mediums. See, it's got the three quarter sleeves. It's a fun length. It's got kind of an asymmetrical where it comes down longer in the front than it does in the back. So I don't know what they call that, like a handkerchief hem, I think. But that's a different style cardigan than I pulled off. That's more of a lighter weight kind of springtime. It's called, it's in a new day um, style. Here is another one of those tank tops, size large. So I'll have to try that one on. <laughs> Make sure it doesn't fit. Here's um, a sheer under slip um, size medium. I'm wondering if this doesn't go to a shirt. I'll have to look, but it's a longer shirt size medium under slip. Oh, that's cute. Look at that. This is an extra large, just women's top, long sleeved, green and navy blue and white. Um, here's some Hanes body toner smoothening underwear. They're kind of coming out of the package, but if I can repackage them real nice, um, then that didn't take much effort. <laughs> um, so I'll probably fix the packaging a little bit in this. Um, but Hanes, sometimes I can find on the Amazon Marketplace. But with the way that this condition is in, I wouldn't want to send it in like this unless I listed it in a, under a different condition like like new or as new. So, oh, here's another one of those shirts that I just pulled out. Um, it looks like this one is a different size. Well, these are pants. Those are... It's a set, PJ pants. Is that an extra large as well? Yes, it's a PJ set. So I'm gonna put the bag with it and it's an actual PJ set, top and pants. Here is a 4X, this looks like a dress. A 4X black button up dress. This is gonna sell so fast because um, because of the size and also because it's black. Um, black solid colors usually sell really fast. Um, it's a very nice condition. There's no picks or tears um, in it. Here is a size large. This looks like a dress. Look at those fun sleeves. It's got kind of a bell sleeve with a ribbon. Um, and some silver detailed neckline on it. Um, and it's a sweater dress. So very stretchy. Um, you probably, I wonder if that's not what that um, sheer uh, underslip was with. Here's some yoga pants. These are size large yoga pants. They're kind of a light gray and a dark gray and then they've got the mesh see-through black part. Oh man, I'm not even, I'm not even like even with this opening barely. All right, here's another sweater dress, extra small. A green sweater dress, very cute. Here's some underwear. 
Now that packaging is great. Uh, this packaging is not so great because it's been opened, but it doesn't look like it's been disturbed. Um, if you look at the packaging there, um, I probably just need to close it up. I'm a dropper. All right, and then uh, this, this packaging is really nice condition. So we're gonna keep all our underwear in one spot. It makes for better sorting at the end so that I can get stuff listed real fast. Set of socks, that's brand new. Um, this is a classic V-neck shirts, men's V-neck shirts, four of them, Goodfellow and Company, size extra large. So the kind you wear under dress shirts or under other polos or something. Swimsuit top, kind of a tank top, sports shirts, halter top kind of thing, medium. Swimsuit bottom, nope. Swimsuit top, exactly the same style, just different pattern on it. I'm gonna put all my swimsuits back here, keep those together. I might find out actual pairs. This looks like a pair of kind of suck it in toner uh, women's underwear, I think. Yep, smooth out all them bumps. Suck it in. So it's very stretchy. Kind of like Spanx. Yep. And then the next thing we got is a cute purple one. We've pulled out a white one and I think a gray one similar to this. This is a size small. It's a kind of a cross, crisscross top there. So it's a little thread from another article of clothing. Let's see we, what else we got. Another swimsuit bottoms, size small. Um, here's condition issue here, um, the button strap thing is totally broken on that one. So these are ones that I for sure cannot sell. So we're gonna put that over there with that sweater we already found the, the snag in. Um, here is a pair of pants, kind of the gaucho pants rompers that people are all into now with some cool ties that crisscross around the front. Size small, kind of a rust brown there. All right, let's see what else we got in here. Yellow, whew, that's a, is it yellow, is it green, is it, I'm not sure, but it's a sweater, size extra large, uh, very soft material, no picks or tears on the back, not on the front. Sorry, I was kind of saying that backwards for you guys. All right, um, here is another sweater. I know it's kind of wrong time of the year and a lot of people ask me, do I save things and sell them during the season? Um, and no, I sell them right away because I don't want to keep my money tied up. And believe it or not, this is a 1X cardigan. Um, things like this sell great this time of the year because you cannot find sweaters in the store. And there are situations where you just need a sweater. Here's some underwear. No, these are sheer pantyhose, sorry. These are underwear. Some more smoothing underwear. Another underwear. Let's see what else we got. Pull out, this one has uh, a hanger. A new day size extra large striped shirt. This is a tankini top. Looks like that. What size is it? It's a, I don't know what size it is. Um, medium, put it back here by the swimsuits. I've got quite a few swimsuits on my Poshmark store if you wanna check out those. I just got a liquidation box of only swimsuits, which was amazing, from a new liquidator I'm kind of trying out before I really kind of start doing unboxes. This is an Ava and Viv 3XL, kind of got the peasant style sleeves on them. Let's see what else we got here. This is a extra small, kind of some interesting sleeves on that one. You can really tell on the back, look at that. That is a tiny little shirt. Of course it is extra small for a very tiny person. Here's a pair of shorts, perfect time of the year to sell shorts. Um, these are size two pink. Um, let me see, they are uh, a new day pink, kind of khaki style of shorts. Uh, sports bra, a champion nine sports bra, extra small, purple, um, with extra padding in it. Let's see. 
some PJ pants, purple and gray plaid PJ pants. I'm gonna set them with my other PJs or size extra large and see if I don't find a top that goes with them. Here's some um, Ru Rudolph? Party from dusk till dawn super socks. That's not Rudolph, that's a walrus. <laughs> it's a walrus, so anyway, uh, a walrus that looks like Rudolph. Here's another one of those uh, cardigans with the pockets in them. Really great shape. I'm really excited about the cardigans because I know that I'm gonna be able to sell them really well. Here's a green one, similar to those first few that I pulled out. So if you want any of these, you're gonna find them at a really good deal on my Poshmark store. Here's the whole, another one of those jumpers. They're pants with a cross um, V-neck top and then tie backs on the sides with pockets. I'm gonna put those over here. All right, here's a green heavy knit sweater, kind of turtleneck style. It's actually a medium, so it would be my size. So it would be one that's kind of almost like one you would wear with leggings, like a dress sweater. Sweater dress, I guess you would say, not dress sweater. Here is a turtleneck, really cute. I don't see any picks and tears on this one. Um, this is a legitimate turtleneck. It's an extra small. Like goes all the way up and has the cowl neck. Here's swimsuit top, um, tankini style. Um, some socks in a bag with a weird, funky llama on it. Llama socks. Took me a minute to figure out what that was. Um, just a bag of underwear random bag of underwear. So on inspected returns, you can get stuff without tags like that on occasion. Um, here's actually new in package underwear. And then this looks like a swimsuit tankini top. Oh no, it's a two, two piece bikini. That's kind of a neat detail on the bottom of the top there. And then the bottoms. So if you're interested in any of these, check them out. All right, here's a scarf. There's the ring, how it would be displayed. That's a fun, pretty scarf. So we'll put it over here. Let's see what else we got. Here's a jacket, a size 14 uh, women's jacket. Um, cute buttons on it. Let's show you the back there. Ooh, I like the buttons on the front. Really nice. We're gonna put that up there by that black jacket. Some more underwear, some more underwear, and some more underwear. And some hose, some black pantyhose. Believe it or not, I sell black pantyhose really well. Here is breathable mesh bikini underwear. Um, bras, Jillian and O'Malley, um, here's a condition issue. Um, that clearly is very dirty. Um, probably got dropped on the floor or something before it got thrown in the box. Now, I wouldn't really take my time on this if it was like a 36C or a B size, but since this is a 40D, those sell really well. I'll probably see if I can't get some spot remover on it and clean it up a little bit, but I'll probably sell it like new instead, even though it has its tags, but like new just because of the staining. Um, but the D cup sizes sell really, really well, especially in this particular brand. Um, so anything that's like a D cup or higher usually sells really well in intimate. So they were smart enough to put this white item inside of a bag to keep it clean. This is an extra large sweater. Very, very, very soft. Isabel maternity sweater. Um, so this is an extra large and it's extra long for the baby belly on that one. So as you can see, we're barely scratching the surface of how far we have actually gotten into this palette, but we're gonna keep plugging away. Here's another white sweater. Looks like this, extra large. Let's see, what else we got in here? We got a, a collared shirt, very soft material. This feels like PJs. 
I think it probably is. This is an extra large, which you want to bet I'm going to find some bottoms that match this here in a minute. Uh, here is a pair of blue jeans already distressed. These are called Wild Fable size 10. Look, uh, they're capris, I think, right? No, maybe not. They're actual jeans, but they have the cuffs. This just tell, screams 1980s to me. <laughs> All right, we've got, what is this top? This is Isabel Maternity again. Maternity stuff sells awesome. So it's a tank top, but it's got a crisscross back on it. And it looks like it's a plus size, probably for extra large. Yeah, 2XL, 2XL on that one. Umbro sweatpants. So they actually have this insert that's supposed to, they're actually attached. You just fold down that. It's actually just sewn in just like that. So Umbro sweatpants, very cute green. Here's another pair, but these exact same style, but these are yoga pants in the exact same style. And wait, wait, now we've got the slick basketball pants. I think that's what they're called. Let's see if we can find any more in this kind of style. Oh, I can't find any more. That was it. But that was pretty funny that they're all the exact same pattern, but different kind of pants. This is a microfiber athletics champion shirt. Um, this one's a size small, long sleeve champion shirt, kind of the kind you want to run in. Um, here's a pair of ladies dress plants, slim ankle, eight regular gray dress pants. Here's a pair of underwear, some more underwear. Some more underwear. <laughs> wait, wait. No more underwear. <laughs> Put those over there. Okay. Oh, I lied. More underwear. <laughs> and some hose. See, so um, let me show you the kind of the options here. So this one, it looks like some of the underwear co is coming out of the packaging. And then this one looks really, really nice. So some of them are definitely Amazon worthy, especially some of the name brands like Fruit of the Loom and Hanes and stuff like that, because I'll be able to find those things on the Amazon marketplace. But some of the other ones I won't be able to, so they'll just go on my Poshmark store. This looks like referee pants. The name of this company is called Junk Food. Buy Junk Food. Look, you think I'm lying. Buy Junk Food. <laughs> So if you want some referee pants, you know where to get them. My Poshmark store. Unless they're on Amazon. Alrighty. Swimsuit top. Black and white. Uh, another swimsuit top. Just a plain white one. Looks like that. It's called Kona Soul brand. This looks like a swimsuit. Yep, this is a one-piece swimsuit and it's got sheer mesh sides on it. Really cute detail in the back. So it's got some see-through parts and some solid parts, um, but relatively modest one. All right. Okay. All righty, let's see. I'm gonna go a little faster so it doesn't take so long. Here's a cute dress, extra small with uh, black with white polka dots on it. Oh, look, I found the other PJ parts. It's the shorts that go to that little PJ top. XXL, put it over there with that PJs. All right, and then I've got a sweatshirt, V-neck sweatshirt. This looks like one you would wear like to work out, throw a tank top on or something with it, a gray one. So far, I'm really loving the condition. Okay, here's pantyhose. This package is terrible. As soon as I say I'm loving the condition, I pull out a terrible package. But, um, but the majority of the clothes are really, really in great condition. Here's a set of overalls. Very nice. Brand new with tags on them. Um, here is another pair of pantyhose. Here's a pair of black jeans, high rise skinny jeans, size six. Let's see, this looks like a dress. 
Yes, a very cute dress. Size medium, Isabel maternity dress. I'm loving all the maternity clothes because that's gonna sell really well. Tis the season, I see pregnant ladies all the time right now. Size large, uh, cold shoulder top, that's very cute. I might have to keep that one. All right, here is a denim dre uh, black dress. Here is a very heavy uh, sweater cardigan, kind of sweatshirt style. More swimsuits, or that, no, this is another top, Isabel maternity top like I pulled out before. Um, here is a really cute child swimsuit, Cat and Jack. Anytime you see Cat and Jack on any of the stuff, here's a set of jewelry, a pair of earrings. So anytime you see Cat and Jack on any of the stuff in um, your manifest, it's going to be kids clothes. Some more underwear, some more underwear, and some more pantyhose. All right, we're just going to keep going. And then we've got this green turtleneck XXL. Very, very soft material. And we have some kind of thick, warm yoga pants. These would be perfect for like running in the winter time. Urban fit legging yoga pants style. And we got some almost wild fable. They look similar to jeggings, but I think they're jeans, new with tags. And then we've got some more blue jeans. Um, size 18 high rise kick flare jeans, women's. Looks like they've, they're a distressed look. Look like that. And then we've got uh, Ava and Viv dress pants, size 16W. They're capris. So with a nice cuff on them. And we've got some more. Um, sweaters a green sweater it's got kind of a, a cinched um, bloused kind of sleeve on it size medium then I've got a pair of shorts these look like they go with swimsuits I guess they're kind of see-through or maybe they're PJ shorts oh I'm trying to pick up the pace a little because there's so many pieces in this box all right here's a halter top tankini and put that over by the swimsuits I got over here. Then I've got a pair of kind of P PJ pants, gray and white. Let's see what else we got in here. Ooh, a nice jacket. That's something else I threw down there. What is this? Some sort of a collar, one size collar piece. Not sure what that, that's for. If you know what that's for, let me know. It's vine thorn is the color, I guess. I'm not sure what that's for. All right, and then here's a really nice jacket. It's got a cinched waist on it, size extra large. It's a navy blue zip up and button up jacket. Let's see. Some kids leggings, glittery leggings, Cat and Jack. Um, a shaping cami for your waist. Um, oops. This is a shaping cami tank top. And looks like another shaping cami full body suit. Uh, this one's a size 3XL. So some intimate undergarments. Those always sell really well. Uh, a couple of pairs of black socks. Um, a dress, a nice velvety dress. I might actually already have this one on my Poshmark store, so I'm going to check. Then I can just change the quantity. I'll look that over, make sure it's brand new with tags, just like the other one was. Um, then I've got a long black dress here with a high neck on it. Then I've got a turtleneck. 
<laughs> I'm throwing these on tables, not just off to the side into oblivion. All right, here is a bathing suit top, yellowish, orangish. Then I've got, these are like a jumper, pants and sleeves, three quarter length sleeves with some ties on it. A bra. Uh, this is a size, like I was telling you, 44 double D. This is going to sell really well. It's brand new with tags. Underwire bra. What is this? Oh my. What in the world? It's a kid's suit. This is amazing. So it comes with the pants and a tie. Look at that. Comes with a tie. This is, here's the picture. It's got like Christmas trees and it looks like it's all been crayon colored on. Oh my goodness, this is amazing. Look at that thing. All right, let me see what size it is real fast. Just so you guys can know, Smith Suitmeister is the brand. I don't see a size, but I would imagine it's like a 38. It just says extra large, extra large in youth. So that's amazing. I'm gonna hang that over here. All right, and then we've got um, a black top. Um, Cuddle Duds um, sweatshirt. Oh my goodness. A sweater with bells. Dabbing through the snow. Oh my goodness, they're dabbing. It's just plain black on the back, but that is amazing. You know you want that. You know you want that. Alrighty, here is a pink long sleeve shirt, Ava and Viv. Here is um, another bra. I actually already have some of these listed. Um, I believe I put these on Amazon. Um, and so they, they sell really well. They're brand new. Make sure there's nothing wrong with them before you send them in the Amazon. That's for sure. Here's a cami, a black camisole. Uh, let's see. Here's a coat. Really nice jacket. Um, champion jacket. What size is this? It's a medium. I have to try it on. Look at that. It's a very nice jacket. Like I said, worst thing about doing these palettes is trying to shop for everything. Pair of yoga pants. Swimsuit bottoms, looks like kid sizes. Yep, G Disney Junior Mini, Mini Mouse ones. So I bet there's a top that goes with that. Here is a sports bra. Here is Universal Thread, size four, and they look like capris because of the bottoms on it. I don't know if they're supposed to be cuffed or if they're just um, cinched like that. Here's just a plain tank top, size medium. Bag of underwear. Here is a uh, Umbro t-shirt. What's it say on it? Umbro. A plain t shirt. Oh, here are the matching swimsuit bottoms to this. Oh my goodness. Here's a cat shirt. Does this turn on? It's got lights attached to it. Let me see if I can figure out how it turns on. Does it actually turn on? It's got wires in here. Oh man. Does it? <laughs> Look at that. That's amazing. <laughs> you know you want that cat shirt. That's amazing. All right, let me turn it off so the batteries don't go dead. So that you can have, it's just got an on off switch in there. It's amazing. Some awesome options for ugly sweaters. Here is a pair of yoga pants, shiny ones. Here is a plain sweatshirt. Uh, 
All right, what else we got? I think I pulled out a dress that looks like this. Yeah, Isabel Maternity. So I've already got a dress that looks like this. So that'll be nice. I can just take one picture of the dress and go ahead and add it to my listings. There's multiple variations in different sizes. There's a, a green long sleeve top. Here is leggings. Some Christmas socks, but these, if you look at condition, there's a string hanging off on. So these are definitely not resellable. So these will probably just go in the trash pile. All right. You've got some slippers. Put those down there. And here's another lavender of that kind of cross sweater. Then I've got a sports bra. And it looks like um, it's a sports top with a built-in bra, if I can figure out how this goes. Isabel Maternity, I pulled out a couple more shirts that are like this, the same color. So they were over there. Um, some socks. So a lot of these smaller things like the socks and the nylons and stuff, I might just do a big bundle of if I can find similar sizes. Um, here's another tank top, a slimming tank top. Uh, here's a cardigan, but it's like a cream color. Um, it has a little belt thing in the back. Very cute. A new day. Here is a tank top, size medium. So some of these are low end. So what I might do is take a few of the tank tops of all the same sizes and make a bundle where I can sell two or three at the same time, you know. Um, Here's a little cami. So I could combine like this tank top with like this one um, if they were both the same size. So that would be, that's an idea of something to do if you want to sell. Here's a really nice long sleeve black shirt. Um, underwear bra. Uh, another underwear bra that's purple. This is an interesting top. Oh, it's like an under. Sure, almost like a halter top, but then you can wear it with a longer shirt, maybe something like this, that way it just shows the top. And then cute dress, size small, very pretty dress, floral dress. Another one of those short tops, but in white. Oh, here's some more Christmas gear. There you go, you know you need it. You look like an elf. Some socks. Some just loose underwear. We'll have to figure out if that goes in a package. Alrighty. Here's another, like a robe it looks like. A New Day robe. For nighttime. Here's Isabel Maternity After Band. Put her on your tummy after your pregnancy. Here's um, thermal pajamas, kind of a wintry pine scene. Here's some shoes. Hold on, let me see if I can get them out without tangling it up. These are size six little cute wedges. Those are very cute. Never been worn, brand new. Set them over here. All right, let's see what else we got in here. What is this? An upside down shirt. Um, it is size large, so it's probably, it's a champion, so it's an athletic wear. Here are some shorts, size double zero. Not my size. <laughs> um, here's another athletic kind of soft shirt, long sleeve gray charcoal. Here are a bunch of socks, cushion, cool comfort, Hanes socks. Another underwear bra with a double lining on it. Here's some holiday socks. 
Here's another holiday sweater. Another one of the elf ones, larger size. Here is a denim jean jacket. Now I know we've gone back to the 80s. A denim jean jacket and even the jacket's cut off. So remember, I paid about $1.63 per item. Here's a pair of really cute size eight, just taupe pumps. Put those down here. Here is a scarf, just like that. Pair of black pantyhose. Um, a set of PJs, looks like it's got winter scene on them. Here's another bra, underwear bra. A hat that says love. String on there, but a hat that says love. Very cute winter hat. Here's another underwire bra. Another underwire bra. Larger size. Let's see. A pair of jeans, brand new. Skinny jeans, size two, dark wash. Another underwire bra. This is similar to one of those larger size ones I got, but um, just a smaller size. Here is a skull t-shirt. Here is a button up shirt, kind of a plaid look, very cute. One pair of socks out of the package. Here is a medium, looks like a hoodie to me. Okay, the tag just fell out, but yeah, it's a, it's a hoodie. It's like a pinkish reddish hoodie, exhilaration. And I do have the tag, it just is not attached. So I'm gonna put it back in here so I keep everything together because I can always use this LP tag here and look it up on the manifest to know exactly what they called it. All right, here's a pair of comfortable shaping waistband tummy flattener leggings. A pair of underwear, t-shirt. Just a plain, oh, this is actually kind of cute. It's got a little bit of ruffled detail on it. It's got the tag piece, Jillian O'Malley, but no tag on it. So that would be new without tags. Um, here's another pair of those same kind of pumps, just size sevens. Really good condition. Pick up some of these clothes there. Here's a tankini top for swimsuit time. Perfect time of the year to do swimsuits. So if you're interested in any of these, just check out my Poshmark store. All right, let's see, we've got PJ pants. And then I've got, these are cute. These are all the rage. These are like, Girls combat boots, style shoes. These are size eights, really cute boots. They have a zip up side on them, brand new, never been worn. And they both are size eight, yes. You always gotta check that, make sure you have both the left and the right foot, because there have been times I've gotten two of the same feet. All right, um, tank top. Underwire bra. Ooh, pair of boots, a pair of brown boots, really nice pair. These are called riding length, size eight. Those are gonna sell great. Cute top here that has a tie front on it, V-neck tie front, 
floral, pink and black, red and black. Here's a pair of Joy Lab fun yoga pants, size medium. Box of shoes. Oh, these are cute. Look at those. Size seven wide, really cute zip up boots. Oh, let me see. We've got some cat leggings, cat Christmas leggings. Cause everybody needs cat Christmas leggings. Alrighty, we've got pantyhose, some more black 14 regular stretch dress pants. Ooh, we pulled this shirt out before. Oh, I got another size of that one. And I've got a nice cute cotton dress. Pair of black sweatpants. Um, Jillian and O'Malley lingerie. Here's a set of PJs with Christmas trees on it. Blue and light blue, navy blue and light blue. Here is a pair of yoga pants. Um, cute cotton dress. It's like a long sweatshirt style dress. Um, and it's tighter at the bottom, XXL. Very cute and soft. All right, here's another tank top, Joy Lab. Very, very comfortable, soft. Another underwear bra. Um, empty package. Ooh, here's a watch, a Timex watch. Looks like that. Really nice, I'll have to check and test it and see if it works. Oh, the second hand is going. Can you see it? So it does work. I'm gonna set that over there so we don't break it. Um, pair, this is a coat, a leather coat. Some more underwear. Um, lifted up backless, strapless plunge bra. Then we've got some black jeans, high rise skinny jeans, size two, 26 S. Here's a sweater, no picks in it. Very cute, size extra large. Cami, slimming cami. Believe it or not, these are worth quite a bit. See, this is original price, $22. And I pulled out quite a few black ones and gray ones of those. So they're worth quite a bit. All right, here is a must have dress. Everybody must have one of these. I might have to just keep this to wear next year. <laughs> you can start early on your ugly sweater Christmas shopping. Here's a cute little um, pants outfit, kind of gaucho short capri pants. Here is a onesie pajama set with a hoodie, extra small. Here is Fruit of the Loom Breathable Performance um, underwear. Here is a cute t-shirt with little black kind of African looking elephants on it. Here is a yellow dressy top. Who, what, where is the brand? Very cute. Here is um, the Nutcracker sweatshirt. It's a fleece fuzzy sweatshirt. Another white bra, sports bra. 
We've got some underwear. We've got a Playtex 18 hour bra. You've got a body silk shaper bra. We've got some Christmas PJs. We've got a swimsuit. One piece swimsuit with ruffles all the way around. That's really cute. What size is that one? Size medium. Very, very cute. I've got a long sleeve purple, a new day shirt. Just lots of variety in here. This probably went with something I've already pulled out. So I'll leave this here on the edge and we'll see if we can find it later. All right, this is a pair of yoga pants. Looks like extra large or XXL. Uh, yeah, XXL, pair of yoga pants. Here's some slippers with a face on them, right? Rudolph Red Nose Raider, women's, oh, it's a, it's a whole mask. Women's union suit. It's like a whole onesie where you can be Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer. Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer in a onesie. All right, this is a pair of shiny yoga pants, kind of the leather looking ones. Put those back in there so they don't get dirty. All right, we've got um, toddler PJs, toddler socks. It's the never ending palette. Okay, a sweater. Interesting decor on it. It's very cute though. Um, another one of those crop tops with the cold shoulder look. Um, this is a sweatshirt, size medium large. It's a fleece, kind of long coat almost. Then it's a regular dressy top here. Sheer. Um, midriff slimmer. But this. Can't sell this. Look at that stain on there. Yuck. So that's going to be in the no-go pile. Swimsuit. Very cute. Perfect time of the year for this. Size large. One piece. Here is a pair of kind of black Ugg looking boots. Size nine. Never been worn. Cute little Decor, very, very soft fabric. So those will sell great, even in the summer. Pair of blue jeans, brand new with no tags on it, but it's got a little bit of a distressed look. Dark wash. Then we've got some, a polka dot bra. We've got some Stormtrooper PJs for toddlers. We've got adult Jillian and O'Malley blue PJs with stars on them. I've got a Christmas sweater. More PJs. Women's size. Uh, more Christmas sweater. Look at that. It's frosty. It's almost like a Christmas dress. All right, there's a green Christmas sweater. Oh, snap. Really nice. We pulled these out before, I believe. Kind of a one piece set with, here's the front. It's got a zipper for back. 
three quarter sleeves on those. We've got some gloves. Got another Christmas sweater, another O oh Snap Christmas sweater. Got some, these are interesting. Look at these. They're kind of stretchy. They're just like a regular red pump, but they've got like a stretchy overlay on them. They're size nines. Those are interesting. Very, very interesting. All right, some more PJs, underwear, and kind of, we'll see if all of them are there. All right, let's pull this box open a little more so we can get in there. Oh, we're slowly getting to the bottom. All right, we've got a slipper. We haven't found the other match. Here are some like tights. This is a sweater dress. It looks kind of like a sweater dress. An Ava Aviv burgundy dress. Here is a really cute, oh, that's the bottom of the dress. It's a peasant style and it's got some cute little details on the bottom, black shirt. Um, some more underwear. Toss those down there. We got some leggings and a random piece of a dress. I'm sure we'll find the piece too. We've got um, another one of those skin bras. All right, let's see, more underwear, more underwear. Let's see, we've got, oh, this is cute. Cute little pants outfit. Not sure what the, oh, that's a tie back on it. Cute little set of burgundy pants. Tights. Um, just a plain size small black t-shirt. Brand new with tags. I'm not sure what this is. It is a pair of underwear. <laughs> a very shiny, tiny piece of underwear. Not sure that constitutes underwear, but okay. A um, couple of rubber bands, and then we've got socks and toes. Ava and Viv sweater. Cardigan sweater with a big cowl neck on it. Let's see, we've got this orange dress, mini dress. That's how it goes. Like a halter style. We've got, this is an athletic shirt, pink and orange. And then we've got a blue um, champion shirt with a fun, fun front on it pair of blue jeans, a puffer coat. These sell really well for me. I'm definitely going to look it over, make sure there's no cuts or slices in it, but it's kind of a trench style puffer coat. Got a bunch of fun holiday socks. These will probably go in a big bundle bunch of these ladies holiday socks and then I've got a little dress oh no these are pants I thought that was a dress but nope universal thread pants outfit here's another Rudolph the red-nosed reindeer Christmas PJ onesie some more nylons more holiday socks, um, body shaper nylons. There's a pair of really cute shoes. These are size eight and a half, very cute, white flats. We're slowly getting to the bottom. Here's a sweatshirt. 
I told you this was like the unboxing marathon. Uh, purple cardigan, just like the ones we started pulling out right at the beginning. Here's a scarf. Pair of nice dress plants, size small. They're like gray. Here is another sweater with a big cowl neck on it. Very cute. Um, polka dot bra. Here's a purple sweatshirt. Okay, this one I definitely would not sell because look at all the pilling. How it's just pilled up and coming apart. I don't know if it's supposed to be like that. But to me it looks pretty terrible. So I probably will not sell that because of all the pilling on it. So that's going to be in the no-go pile. All right, Ava and Viv dress. Sorry if I'm sniffling a little bit. My allergies are bugging me a little bit today. Ooh, this is a cute little sweater. It's like one of those long ones you'd throw on with some leggings. Here is a, like a half shirt sports bra, Joy Lab. Here is a, another bra. Really cute dress, polka dot, black and white polka dots, or blue, sorry. Here are some Christmas tree socks. Some more holiday sock sets. I'm gonna throw those over there. Here's some more holiday PJ sets. I'm gonna come over here on this side, see if I can reach in here this way. Here is, um, this is a sweatshirt. Let's see. A purple top. XXL sweatshirt. That actually looks like a men's. Most of this has been women's clothes so far. Here is a white, what is on this? A white sweatshirt. Kiss me. Looks like it's PJ, a PJ top. Super soft leggings. Um, some underwear. Here's some more of those holiday socks and some more pantyhose. All right. Here's a sports bra, some Christmas socks, Christmas PJs again. All righty. Something sparkly. We must look at the something sparkly. What is the something sparkly? It's a dress. No, it's a top. It's an extra, extra large women's top. It's very sparkly and rainbowy. You know you need it. You know you want it. It's calling your name, isn't it? Super sparkly rainbow top. Alrighty. Some yoga pants. 501 items. Is it ever going to end? <laughs> All right, this says NASA on it. I've been noticing a lot of NASA clothes. It's been surprising to see how much. Um, pair of just PJ shorts. Um, a plain white t-shirt. Um, some stonewashed jeans. Now we really have entered the 80s. Um, a sweater that looks like it's overalls, but it's all attached. A sweater dress. A Jojo bow. Actually has the little icon for Jojo. All right, let's see what else we got in here. We've got underwear packs. Set those right there. We've got, um, this is a short sleeved sweater cardigan if i can find the other sleeve oh no it's a sleeve and a sleeve it's like a shrug but it's a larger size maybe not it's a size small but it's one of those long hanging down ones 
Um, here's some more sets of underwear. More sets of underwear. Here's a black and tan bra. What is this? This is a sleeveless top. Very cute. Black and white. Kind of a bluish black and white. Um, PJs. What's in the box? Mystery box. What's in it? I want you to guess, so I'm going to put it right here. We're going to find out what's in that box. All right, we've got a bra, a bra, some yoga pants. Let's see if we can get all the bras out of here. Another bra. Ooh, this is like a whole corset. So it goes down the whole waist and everything and snaps in the front. Let's see what else we got in here. I'll try to pull some of this forward so that we can get it out of the box. All right, here's another bra. Try not to kill myself getting in and out of this box. Put all those over there. Okay, keep, keep thinking about what's in this mystery box, okay? What is in this mystery box? All right, here is a whole tank top, PJs, a robe, elf suit, We've got a nice athletic shirt, champion brand. Um, a tank top, but it's kind of a quilted, thicker fabric. Some fun kind of windbreaker pants. Pair of jeggings, high-waisted jeggings. Um, on the naughty list. It's one of those change the letters and stuff because you flip it the other way. A tank top, PJ top. Probably goes with a pair of pants that I have found. Some underwear, another bra, some more underwear, some more underwear, some more underwear. So if you're going to get a pallet of 500, you're going to get lots of underwear and pantyhose and tank tops so far, <laughs> but lots of other really good stuff. Here's a size medium sweater, very pretty blue sweater, very, very soft, lightweight, so you don't sweat to death in it. All right, what else we got? Is this an apron? It's an apron. It even matches my shirt. Look, now I feel like Betty Crocker. Very cute. Christmas socks again. Gray sweater. Bra. Sports bra. Orange shirt with a fr fun front on it. It's an Ava and Viv um, 4X. Very, very soft material. Pair of suck it in shorts. T-shirt. Dream on, ba dream on, baby. Okay, um, green top. Yoga pants, shiny ones. Let me see, tank top. Toddler socks, pantyhose. All right, come on. Um, Santa Claus slippers. All righty, let's see. Pair of black jeans with tags on it, size 12. This mountain's getting as high as me next to me. Um, some more ladies holiday socks. Here's another apron with little roses on it. 
Okay, this is definitely not resellable. If you look at these, they're a pair of pants with a crazy chain on them, but if you look at them closely, they're just covered and covered in cat hair. Either cat hair or it's like the white sweaters that were in the palette, but I'm not gonna de-lint these whole things because that'll be too much work. <laughs> not worth it to me. All right. Cute top with some lace uh, shoulders. We've got exhilaration fashion leggings. Some more Christmas socks, a bunch more Christmas socks, a bunch more Christmas socks. Here's a box. Used to have shoes in it. I probably pulled the shoes out already, I bet. Here's a, a turtleneck black sh shirt. black sweater joy lab um gray top purple bra that clasps in the front like so purple underwear bra cute little back on it crisscross back on it Let's see, some tights, kind of thick wool tights. Let's see, these are leggings, some army, they're kind of gray army leggings. Here's a tankini top with a really cute back on it. So I'm excited about the swimsuits because I can definitely sell those right now for sure. Okay, here's a black hoodie. Very, very soft and lightweight. And it's got the front pocket on it. Here is um, Christmas PJs. Some more underwear. 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 Nylons. Here's a black underwear bra. It's stiff. I wonder if this is a swimsuit because it's totally stiff. See? <laughs> All right, here's a sports bra, champion. Um, pair of wool socks. Underwear, bra. Holiday socks. Go in my holiday sock pile over there. What is this? A towel, a random white towel. Another bra. Here is a swimsuit. Looks like child size. Oh, it can't be child size. I think it's junior size. Size small in women's because it's got um, pads in the upper part. Here is a bikini set, top and bottom. Here is the Grinch PJs. Hey, look, I found my other slipper. It's a match. All right, don't forget about the mystery box. Oh, this is a cute little dress. Got little pretend candy canes in there. Got some leggings. And um, a swimsuit bottom. Ooh, these are cute. Look at these, these are black, size 10 flats. Bethany, size 10. I have a friend named Bethany. Brand new black flats. She wears size 10, she's very tall, so she doesn't need heels. All right, um, some Christmas socks. So, a really cute top, kind of a peplum style top. Pair of black blue jeans, high rise skinny, size 16 with tags on them. Here is another green swimsuit with the top. Here is, um, it's a Medela um, breast pump where you can wear both your breast pumps at the same time, hands free. Here is, a really pretty 
sweat sweatshirt. Here's a floral top, very cute. It's a dress. It's actually a dress. A bra, swimsuit bottoms. Set those there. A pair of PJ pants. All right, let's see. We've got some gloves, some more socks, some more gloves, some underwear, swimsuit bottoms, a pair of PJ shorts, a pair of yoga pants, um, a pair of gray leggings. Here is an army sweatshirt, some socks, leggings with a really cute design on them, some more elf PJs, some more of those Christmas socks. Here's a sports bra. Here's a pair of yoga pants, baby 12 month leggings. Here's a interesting looking top. Let's see what it looks like inside. It says Star Wars Chewbacca. That's cute. Kind of an off-white. Um, pair of socks. Pair of socks. Pair of socks. Um, really nice sports bra. Uh, let's see. A pink sweater. A purple sports bra, larger size. Some yoga pants. A pair of sweatpants. Ooh, a puffer coat. Look at that. It's kind of smaller size, size medium. <laughs> Excuse me. Maybe it's dusty down here in the bottom. All right, um, some red plaid PJ pants, some distressed jeans, uh, another set of PJs, a really nice swimsuit with the cute cutout sides, bright yellow, some leggings, some more yoga pants, now this is a crazy looking outfit. Look at this. That is crazy. Look at the sides of those rainbows. There's an outfit for you. Um, we've got some underwear, swimsuit bottoms. We've got, what is this? It's a hat, kind of a spirally hat. Um, swimsuit bottoms, some more socks, um, a tank top, I'm not sure, this is an apron, don't worry, I'll get to the mystery box, here's a tankini top, another swimsuit top, really cute, uh, back on that, here's the front of it. Here are some leggings. <laughs> wow, these are forest green with gold specks. Those are impressive. Uh, here is another tankini top, kind of ruffled. A gray shirt, a black tank top, gray leggings, a brown sweater, I believe. Yes cardigan sweater. Down to the last couple and then I'll open that mystery box. Here's a bodysuit. And the last item we have in here is a long black shirt. Okay, so we're going to see what's in this mystery box. Okay, so I asked you guys to guess. Hopefully you've been putting some fun guesses on there. And we're going to see what's in here. I'm just going to open this box terribly. Oh, these are nice. Look at those. 
brand new wedge heel brown boots. What size are they? Size seven. Those are super cute. I know I can get really good money out of those. Absolutely nothing wrong with them. No scuffs or marks on them at all. Those are, are going to be awesome money. Hopefully I can find them on Amazon. If not, they'll be at my Poshmark store. So hopefully in this mountain of stuff, you saw some awesome things that you know that I can make money on. 501 items out of a bulk women's clothing box. And hopefully it's been helpful to see what you can get out of a box with this many items. Sorry, it took so long to get through everything. Hopefully you were able to fast forward if I got annoying. And remember in the end, Jesus wins. You guys are true blessing in my life. Thank you so much for helping me put this content out there to everyone. If you'd like to join these great people, please consider supporting me through my Patreon page. Check the link below. Hey, thanks for watching. I hope you learned something. If you'd like to watch more of my videos, just click on them here. And if you'd like to learn more about the reseller world, subscribe to my channel and check out my other videos. Thanks.